Welcome back to the clinic. How are you doing today? Mm. Are you well? Okay. How have you been eating and sleeping recently? How's that been going? Yeah. Mm. Yeah, it's important to get those three meals a day. Eight hours of sleep. It's understandable. I don't do that all the time as well. It just happens, but it's best to try and stick to it. Yeah. Okay, well, today, between me and you, okay, between me and you, between me and you, this session is specifically for you, okay? Most assessments I'm supposed to keep the same, and everyone is supposed to have the exact same experience, okay? But this time, this today, is it's just for you, okay? So we're going to get started. Is that all right? Or do you have any questions? Great, okay. So I'm going to start with scanning your aura, just sort of, you know, you know how it is, just sort of, we want to make sure that none of that negative energy is left over because it can sneak in occasionally and it's not that good. We want to get rid of that before we start. So I'm just going to come in. It's quite I'm gonna start scanning. I'm gonna start scanning. I'm gonna start scanning for any of that negative energy, which it can just get in when you really don't want it to. Because the shield in your aura is pretty strong, and most of the time it's blocked. But sometimes you won't even know it's there, and it will just sneak in, and it will affect you in a variety of different ways. But normally those ways aren't very good. So we're just going to come in and... We're going to come in here and just sort of get rid of any of those negative bits that we don't want. Okay, fantastic. Let me just... seems to all be gone now actually. I think I think we're safe to continue. I think we're very much safe to continue. Fantastic. 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 Okay. So the next thing, or shall I say the first thing that I want you to do, and as this is personalized to you, you can already you can feel it, can't you? You know what's coming next. Yeah, I thought you would do. I want you to close your eyes for me. Close your eyes. Close. Close. Close your eyes. Close your eyes. Close your eyes, okay? Close your eyes for me. Sit back and relax. And close your eyes. Close. So, now that your eyes are closed and everything is nice and calm, the first thing that I want you to do is to breathe along with me, okay? So I want you to breathe in for me, nice and deep. And then I want you to breathe out. Okay. And now breathe in. And breathe out. Okay. Three more times. Okay. Breathe in. And breathe out. Okay. Breathe in. And breathe out. One more time. Breathe in. And 
close your eyes, okay? Fantastic. You're doing a great job so far, okay? Now, the first thing I want you to do, now that you've done the breathing exercises, and that we've cleansed your aura, I've got this brush here, and I'm going to make some noises with it, some sounds. And I want you to tell me how many times you hear the sound, okay? So I'm going to take the brush out of its plastic sleeve, like so. I'm going to take it out of its plastic sleeve. And what I want you to do is I want you to count the amount of times that you hear the sound, okay? I'm going to count how many times you hear the sound, okay? So, are you ready? Are you ready? Just make sure those eyes are closed. Okay, make sure that those eyes are closed. Closed, 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 closed. Closed, 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 closed. Okay. So, make sure that you're focusing. I'm going to start making those sounds now. Okay, how many times did you hear that? Good, well done. That was four times. It was four times. Okay, you're doing a fantastic job. You're doing a fantastic job. We're going to do it again, okay? So I've got the brush once more. And I'm going to make a sound with it. And I want you to tell me how many times you hear it. So How many times? Excellent. Well done. That was seven times. Well done. You're doing a fantastic job. Well done. Well done. Well done. Well done. You're doing amazing. Okay, we're going to do this two more times, okay? We're going to do this two more times. Here we go. times? How many times? How many times? How many times did you hear the brush? Good. Well done. It was three times, okay? Well done. Well done. Keep those eyes closed for me. Keep those eyes closed. Keep those eyes closed. Keep those eyes closed, okay? Keep those eyes closed. time, okay? One more time. And I just want you to count the amount of times that you hear the brush, okay? I want you to count the amount of times that you hear the brush. So, focusing, focusing, focusing. 
relaxing with your eyes closed. Okay, focusing with your eyes closed. Closed, closed, closed. Okay, here we go. One last time. Okay, there was quite a few more in that time. Did you manage to count them all? Fantastic, well done, that was 14 times. Well done, well done, well done. You're doing a fantastic job, you're doing a fantastic job. Just make sure to keep those eyes closed, okay? Keep those eyes. Okay, so the next thing that I'm going to do is a little bit of a word game. We're going to do a little word game, okay? So the little word game that we're going to play, I'm going to say four words. I'm going to say four words, four words, four words. And three of them, three of the words, will match up together. They will make sense. They will be part of a group. They will be part of a group, they will make sense together, and they will fit next to each other in some sort of sequence, or they will all sort of associate with each other, okay, as part of a group. But one of the words, the fourth word, one of the words, will make no sense as part of this group, okay? So, an example, okay, yep, yeah, an example would be red, orange, yellow and computer. So, it might seem obvious, but the first three that I said were colours, and the fourth option was not a colour. Now I would be shuffling these up, so it might be red, computer, orange, yellow, but one of the words does not make sense, okay? And I want you to tell me which word you think is the odd one out. And you get bonus points if you tell me why it's the odd one out, okay? Now you don't have to tell me why. If you want to just say the word, then that's completely fine. But if you can tell me, then you get a bonus point, okay? Okay, your first set of words is orange, pineapple. Pear and cucumber. Orange, pineapple, pear and cucumber. Which one do you think was the odd one out? Okay, well done. It was cucumber. Well done. Well done. Make sure to keep those eyes closed. Closed, 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 closed. Keep those eyes closed. Closed, 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 Your second set of words is oak, birch, table and spruce oak birch table and spruce okay 
What was the odd one out that time? Good. It was table. The odd one out was table. Well done. 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 You're doing a fantastic job. Just make sure to keep those eyes closed, okay? Keep those eyes closed. So you had gold, diamond, potato, and emerald. Which one was the odd one out? Which one was it? Good, well done. Well done. Well done. Well done. The odd one out was potato. Well done. Because potato, as much as it might want to be, isn't a precious stone. Or a mineral. Okay. Yeah. Well done. So the next thing that I'm going to do is just take a break. Okay, we're going to take a break. And I'm just going to come in gently, if it's okay with you. And I'm going to brush your face. Is that okay? Okay, great. So just relax for me. Keep those eyes closed. I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna come in here and I'm gonna brush your face, okay? Nice and gentle. You're doing a fantastic job. As you always come in to the clinic and you get everything right you put in so much effort and you do a fantastic job I'm so proud of you for your commitment and you should be proud of yourself too and I really appreciate Okay, so now, if you're feeling a little bit more relaxed, we're going to move on to the next exercise. But of course, as for the rest of this assessment, I want you to keep those eyes closed for me. Keep those eyes closed. Okay, so next I want to test your intuition, okay? So I'm going to hold up some fingers in front of you and I want you to keep those eyes closed and I want you to guess how many fingers that I'm holding up, okay? I'll give you five seconds and then I will tell you the number that I was holding up and we can see if our answers match or not, okay? 
but obviously you can't see. Don't worry if you don't get them right. This is just really testing the intuition, okay, and your thought processes. So keep those eyes closed for me. Keep those eyes closed for me. Keep those eyes closed. 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 Okay, so I'm now holding some fingers in front of you. I'm going to give you five seconds. Five, four, three, two, one. How many do you think I was holding up? Okay, there was two. I was holding up two fingers, okay? And again, I'm now holding up some fingers. Five, four, three, two, one. How many fingers was I holding up? Okay, I was holding up four that time. I was holding up four fingers. And now, five, four, three, two, one. How many fingers am I holding up? Good, okay. I was holding up one finger, okay? And again, five, four, three, two, one. How many fingers am I holding up now? Okay, I was holding up five fingers. And one more time. Five, four, three, two, one. How many? Okay, I was holding up two fingers again that time. Okay. Well done, well done, well done, well done. Keep those eyes closed for me. Keep those eyes closed for me. Okay, so I'm going to go again, and this time I'm going to use both of my hands. So the range will be from 1 to 10, instead of 1 to 5. Keep those eyes closed for me. How many fingers am I holding up now? 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. I'm holding up four fingers, okay? Four fingers are being held up. And what about now? Five, four, three, two, one. How many fingers am I holding up? Okay, I'm holding up eight this time. I'm holding up eight fingers. Okay. And again, how many fingers am I holding up this time? Five, four, three, two, one. How many? Okay, there was only two that time. Only two fingers. I was only holding up two fingers. Okay, and the last one. How many fingers am I holding up? Five. Four, three, two, one. How many fingers am I holding up? Seven. I'm holding up seven fingers. Well done. Well done. You're doing a fantastic job. Just make sure to keep those eyes closed, okay? Keep those eyes closed. Okay, so we're now just going to check up on your aura again. So I'm going to bring in a light and I'm just going to check to make sure that everything is still. Because it's very easy for things to just pop in here and there, which we 
you don't want. You know, with, with everything spinning around in your head. Of course we don't want that. So, while I am checking your aura, I want you to imagine an island. I want you to imagine an island. Okay. Is this island big or is it small? Okay. Does the island have trees or is it a sandy island? Is it a rocky island? Is it a mountainous island? Is it a grassy island? What does your island have on it in regards to the terrain and the wildlife? Okay. And is this island occupied by people or is it a desolate island? That island hasn't been discovered yet, or has been abandoned. Okay. Interesting. Yeah, hold on, I think I might have something. Let me just go in here. Okay, that seems fine. And most importantly, most importantly, does your island have treasure buried on it, or not? Okay, fantastic. Just keep those eyes closed for me. Keep those eyes closed. Keep those eyes closed. Keep those eyes closed. Okay, so now what I want you to do is focus on the sound of my voice, okay? I want you to focus on the sound of my voice. I am going to now make some sounds and I'm going to count from one, okay? And I want you to focus on my counting and ignore all of the sounds that you hear, okay? I want you to ignore all of the sounds that you hear and only focus on my counting, okay? Are you ready? Good, okay, we will begin. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. So we're going to do one last exercise. 
before we finish and then we will do some breathing exercises and then we will end today's session okay so the exercise we're going to do is going to be some word association okay so I'm going to say one word and I just want you to tell me the first word that comes into your mind keep those eyes closed for me and remember that even if you can't think of a word, you can just say the word that I say. However, it is better if you think of a word that's different, okay? And if I say the same word twice, then I want you to think of a different word to the one that you replied with previously. Okay? Sound good? Alright. Keep those eyes closed for me. Keep those eyes closed for me. Keep those eyes closed for me. Okay, so your first word is diamond. Your first word is diamond. What do you think of? Next word is keyboard. Your next word is keyboard. What do you think of? Okay, well done. Okay, yeah. And why was that your answer? Interesting, yeah. Great, okay. Next word. Okay. Your next word is explosion. Your next word is explosion. What do you think of? your answer. <laughs> That's a good one. Yeah. Well done. Well done. Well done. You're doing great. Okay. Your next word is sleep. Your next word is sleep. What do you think of? did you get? Okay. Yeah. Great. And why is that? Okay. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Okay. Fantastic. We're going to do two more words, okay? Two more words. Keep those eyes closed for me. We're almost there. We're almost there. Your second last word, your next word is crystal. Crystal. What do you think of? Cough. 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 Okay. What made you think of that answer? Crab. 
the final word. The final word is crap, okay? Crap. The final word is crap. The final word is crap. What do you think of? What do you think of? your answer. Okay, great. And why was that your answer? Okay, fantastic. You did a great job. You did a great job. You did a great job. You did a fantastic job. You did a brilliant job. Now keep those eyes closed for me, okay? Keep those eyes closed for me. We're going to do a little bit of breathing. And then we're going to end today's session, okay? So, you can breathe at your own pace, or you can follow along as always. But if you are following along, then breathe in for me. And breathe out for me. Breathe in for me. And breathe out. Breathe in for me. And breathe out. Breathe in. Breathe in. And breathe out. And for the last time, breathe in. Okay, well it is that time of the day where I must sadly say goodbye to you, as it is the end of the session. But as always, you have been absolutely fantastic, and I look forward to our next appointment. So thank you so much for coming down today, and until the next time.